one on. Oh wow, I have seaweed on my lip. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Starting my morning off with a scoop of One Up Nutrition Greens and Red Superfoods drink. First thing I drink upon waking on an empty stomach, it's a probiotic for the gut. It helps to alkaline the body and it'll sort you out with all of these superfoods and digestive aids, if you know what I mean. What's going on guys and welcome to today's video. Currently sitting at the airport in the train right now. We are headed to Hoi An. It's about 9, 10 in the morning. Our flight leaves in an hour. And then we're going to be there for five days. And I'm so excited just to be in one place for a little while because we've been consistently on the go. So it's going to be awesome. We're going to be booking um, our tours to go to the rice paddies and to go to Halong Bay and everything like that. So I feel like this vlog is going to have a ton of adventure. We're starting with a full day of eating though because I know that it can be difficult to stay on track or just when you're in a different country you don't really know what to eat so I'm just gonna show you guys everything that I'm eating today starting with two things that I already ate because I am so starving right now we woke up at 6 and it's already 9 so so I am starving by this point I ate an RX bar with some almond butter on top about probably about 40 minutes ago now and then I just ordered these shrimp salad rolls because I saw Paige eating them and I often get food FOMO and we just finished these as well. All right, you guys, we made it and we are so happy. So we spent a little bit more on that plane ride just because sometimes if you wait until last minute, you can get a really good deal or sometimes they rack up the price. So we did spend a bit more on that, but since considering our bus ride or the train ride rather that we were going to take was gonna be like nine hours. We took an hour plane ride and saved ourselves literally eight hours of the day. <laughs> it's not even noon yet. We have a full day to explore and we are already liking what we are seeing. So let me show you. We're about to cross this bridge right now. Not exactly sure what this is, but we'll Google it. <laughs> we are taking a drive, a ride, <laughs> to our Airbnb and I know that a lot of you guys are going to be asking like where did you stay, how did you plan that kind of thing and honestly we've been pretty lucky finding awesome Airbnbs for pretty cheap while we're out here. Like this place is only $24 a night and they do still use Airbnb in this side of the world so that's what we've been doing instead of hostels and stuff and I'm very surprised at how far our dollar is going for our accommodation so I'll definitely show you guys that as well. We made it and we just came to a small little restaurant while we were waiting about half an hour for our room to be ready. We have such a good feeling about Hoi An already because our host is amazing. She's given us the deets, telling us exactly what we need to do and yeah, I just feel like it's going to be a really great five days. First things first, starting off with some veggies. We have a tuna salad here, some dressing on the side. And then for the second part of our meal, we might order more, not quite sure, but we have a vegetable soup here. I'm not sure if it's pho, but it is vegetarian. Okay, so I want to quickly show you our Airbnb before we unpack even more. <laughs> I'm about to take a shower because I'm all sweaty. So this is the sleeping quarters and then we have these little chairs here for this TV. And then we have one terrace right here. I'm drying some of the stuff that I just washed. We go over here. This is a huge bathroom and there's like the big tub and then this is the shower type of thing. And then we have a second patio on this side and this is the view. It's so bloody hot out. It's quite big. 
Okay guys, so today is a very low-key day. We haven't had one of these days yet. We've been consistently on the go. So every vacation, it's not really every, it's not even a vacation really, but every travel event that we do, we need to have one day to literally do nothing. So that's what we're doing. We're hanging out in the apartment. I'm getting a bunch of work done and just chilling, recharging for tomorrow. We just booked our scooter tour that's going to be the day after tomorrow so tomorrow we're going to explore Old Town and I'm so excited but today we're still doing our full day of eating so we just got back to the restaurant down the street for some dinner so we're starting off with some salad and then we have a couple other things coming got some fried egg here that is very very oily unfortunately so we're gonna make that work and then some bok choy just blotting off all of the oil on our fried eggs. Oh my gosh, it's really bad, guys. <laughs> Found our way to a vegan joint, and here we have some mushroom and tofu patties. We have an onion and carrot salad with some fresh peanut sauce. And then we have the summer rolls that also have some tofu and vegetables in there. Day two. What's going on guys? Today is going to be a day full of adventure because we're headed off on a motorcycle tour. A private tour at that. We have a full day plan. We're going to go to Monkey Mountain. We're going to go to the beach, the countryside. So excited. Trusting this guy with my life right now. I'm trusting you with my life right now. Do it. Mom, <laughs> it's gonna be so much fun. Let's do it. This is a papaya tree. And so is most of the- And this of is lemongrass. Like and it smells so good, you guys. Mmm. Wow. I'm just gonna like hold on to this all day. Do you think they think I'm a weirdo? I had no idea that this is all peanuts, you guys. This is how they're harvested. You can eat them, you know that? Really? I wanna try. Okay, just eat this. Yeah. yeah. So we're in another peanut field right now. Cool. Good there we job. Go. I could do this. First stop is Marble Mountain. We have about 200 steps to climb. Already getting a quad pump here. It's called Marble Mountain because this is where they get all the marble. <laughs> but there's actually like massive statues that are so gorgeous all along this road and a bunch of like little souvenirs at the bottom. Might even get one for my little apartment. It's really beautiful though. So apparently there's like a cave in here, a temple. Let's go see. Wow. Oh my God, look at this little girl's outfit. So oh my gosh. Little ballerina. Just rode the bike all the way up and over and through the mountain and now we're at this little waterfall that is so cute kind of just want to jump in it's like this little terrace and these people are having a picnic I wonder if they'll invite me for their picnic hello hello just got to lunch and we're having a vegetarian hot pot soup.
All right, guys, so just got home. We went out for dinner when we got back to our hotel. And now I'm gonna wrap up this video here. I had so, so much fun today. I got a lot of sun. Look, at that's like the backpack mark. <laughs> but honestly, like today was just an amazing day and I feel like I really got to explore Hanoi. Sorry, Hoi An. I'm going to Hanoi next. But yeah, I feel like I gave it a really good go. We went over to Da Nang. We went up into the mountains. I feel like I thoroughly explored the surrounding areas and I'm falling more and more in love with Vietnam every single day of this trip. So I hope that you guys enjoyed hanging out with me as well. If you did, please do not forget to show your support by giving the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see what we're doing tomorrow. Love every single one of you guys. Thank you so much for watching.